guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am filming a Q&A for you guys and I haven't done one of these on this channel ever. I haven't really made that many videos on this channel. <laughs> I'm starting now because I just got my new laptop, but um, I did a Q&A on the Maddie and Elijah channel, so this is my first one by myself. I'm a little nervous, but I hope I can answer some of the questions that you guys have and let's get right into it. So I did have you guys ask me questions on Instagram and Twitter, so I'm just going to read whatever username that I see on either one, um, just so I can give you guys a quick shout out for your question. So the first question is from Carolyn. She said, what's your favorite eyeshadow palette? Um, my favorite eyeshadow palette is the Urban Decay Born to Run. I think it has every single color that I could possibly need, and the packaging is beachy and gorgeous. So the next question is from Antonio, and he said, what are you studying? So I'm studying dentistry. I would have been further in my career if I knew what I was doing ahead of time, but I kind of wasted a bunch of time like not knowing what I was gonna do. And now I'm like really behind, but yeah. <laughs> Maddie, ooh, cute name. She asked, favorite place to eat in Cleveland? Um, I like the chocolate bar. I love the, what is it called? Alfredo pasta. So <laughs> chicken Alfredo, okay. I love that. Next question is Anna. She said, Are you going to do a clothing haul? I have a bunch of hauls planned and I didn't want to like overwhelm you guys with like a bunch of hauls because I have like a bikini one coming, a clothing one coming, like a fall one coming. I love clothes, so that'll probably be a lot of videos on my channel. So hopefully you like that. So the next question is Lola or Lala, I don't know. Um, she said, Do you have natural highlights in your hair? Did you dye it? Um, I did, I do actually have like a little bit of caramel highlights, but this blonde that you see, like the, this, that's all dyed. Not dyed, I just got it lightened. Miracle asked, do you and Elijah want to get married and have kids in the future? I love you too, and yes, I do want to get married and have kids. Probably only two. I don't want any more than that. <laughs> Ooh, Sophia, she asked, have you ever thought of making merch for your separate channel? Love you. I love you too. <laughs> um... No, I have not thought about that. I just don't think I'm big enough yet. Hopefully I grow a little bit more, but right now, mm -mm, I don't think people would really buy it. I don't know, until I get bigger, maybe. Tala asked, how old are you? I am 19, almost 20. I am turning 20 in two months. Okay, this is a good question because a lot of people get confused with this whole situation. Um, this question is from Alani. I don't know if that's how you say it, but... She said, do you and Elijah both live at home and visit each other or what? Like everyone I think is confused of like this whole, like how we see each other all the time if we live six hours away. Okay, let me explain. Okay, so Elijah used to live six hours away from me and he was at the very bottom of Ohio. I was at the very top. And about a year ago after we graduated high school, he actually moved up to Cleveland with me. Um, not in the same house. He actually moved in with my grandma, which is only five minutes away from my house. So like when you see us like in the couple night routine and stuff, he actually is here and then he just drives five minutes home. They're like, he drives the six hours home every night? No, 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 no. He moved up here, so he lives up here. So like we only live five minutes apart and we see each other every day. So it's like, it's, I like that. I'd rather have that than being 300 plus miles away. <laughs> Next question. So Alexandria asked, is it worth it to wait for the right guy instead of dating okay guys in the meantime? I mean, yeah, it's worth it to wait for the right guy. I mean, I don't know how you're gonna know if he's like the right guy if you don't date him. I'm like not good at answering these kind of things because I've only had one boyfriend and he's more than an okay guy. So it's like, I don't know. I think, yeah, if you wanna wait and you're like looking for like your certain someone, I would say, yeah, it's okay to wait. That's how I answered it. I don't know, that's just how I see it. Next question is, would you have your own makeup line? Let's see who asked that. Vera, okay, Vera, listen to me. I would love to have my own makeup line. I don't know how you would even start about doing all that, but maybe someday, I love that. That's such a cute idea. Oh, okay, this is a good question. This is from Taylor Lee. She said, how do you make your makeup and not blotchy or come off at the end of the day? She said primer. Um, yeah, primer is a part of it, but it's like so many key things that go into play of your makeup staying on all day. So it's like primer, you have to have the right foundation for your skin type. So if you're oily, make sure you get a primer, I mean a foundation that doesn't have a bunch of like oils in it. Um, that'll help. Uh, a lot of powder if you're oily. I'm oily, so I use a lot of powder. Um... Definitely setting spray, definitely. Primer, foundation, powder, 
and setting spray. Those four things I think are like my main things that keep my makeup on all day. Oh, this is a cute question. Okay, Olivia asked, what's your favorite thing slash least favorite thing about being a YouTuber? Um, my favorite thing is meeting you guys. That's like my number one. I love like to meet the people that you know, have made me happy and the people who I've made happy. I love to just hug them and talk to them. Um, and then my least favorite thing, I don't know if I have a least favorite thing. I mean, everything comes with good and bad, so it's like, I'm not complaining by any means. I love what I do. <sighs> I'd say my least favorite thing is like, people just commenting stuff that they don't even know anything about, like, just making assumptions and like, pointing out people's flaws. That's like my least favorite thing. It's like, shut up, you know nothing. It's just stupid people, I really just, that's my least favorite, stupid people. <laughs> Trying to put their comment in there like they know what they're talking about, but they don't. Next. Um, oh, this is cute. Kim asked, how does your relationship stay so strong? Um, I would say a big thing is communication, especially when we were long distance, we really had to communicate. That was important. Um, and also doing like little things that you would do like when you first met, like opening the door for each other and stuff like that. I think that's important. Oh, this is a, this is a good, this is a good question. It's from Laura. She said, how is it trying to juggle going to college and doing YouTube at the same time? It's freaking hard. It is. But actually for this semester, it's not as bad as it used to be. Um, for Elijah, that's bad because he's doing five classes, but I like lowered my classes a little bit so I have more time. But like you also have to remember that like I have another job. If I don't know if you guys know that, but so does Elijah. He works sometimes like 13 hours at a time. So like it's really hard for us to do work, YouTube, and school at the same time. But now I lowered my schedule and I have time a little bit, so here I am. But yeah, it's bottom line, it's really, really hard. L Bell asked, what is your Snapchat? My Snapchat is live underscore wild. Don't even ask about the name. I don't even know why. I was little when I picked it and you can't even change your username, so I'm stuck with it. But anyway, that's it. Go follow it. All right, now I'm gonna switch to my Twitter questions. What's your dream vacation? This is from Jasmine. Um, Definitely, I wanna go to Bora Bora and for sure Italy. Those are like my top two places that I wanna go. Jody asked, what weird food combinations do you enjoy? I don't really mix up my food that much. I guess I have two. I like corn and mashed potatoes mixed. And I like, this is everybody I think knows this, it's like chocolate ice cream and fries mixed. Boom. I don't even know if that's weird because everybody dips their fries in ice cream. So I guess the corn and mashed potato one is like a little bit more weird, I don't know. Kathy asked, what would you tell your 12 year old self? Um, I would say it's not that deep. That's what I'd say, because I always like took things so seriously and like, even with friends, if like they, whatever we're in a fight, it's like not that deep, we're still friends, so. I don't know, I'd say it's not that deep. <laughs> Aw, Mia, I miss you so much. I met her in Niagara Falls. She said, what's your favorite memory about high school? <laughs> Nothing, just kidding. I guess I can have, I can find one. I would definitely say Homecoming with Elijah. That was really fun. I'm asked, what's your favorite Netflix show? Um. I love Riverdale, I love American Horror Story, Scream, Walking Dead, yeah, that's it, okay. I love those ones. <laughs> oh, Maddie asked, what would your dream wedding be like? I wanna get married already, I like, it's so cute. My dream wedding is on the beach with the ocean and cute little flowers and really beachy and nature-y. I definitely for sure want it to be on the beach. All right, next question is from Sebastian. He said, what is your life plan? Where do you see yourself in 10 years? Um, I see myself doing YouTube, hopefully, even if I don't even get views anymore because it'll be 10 years. Um, I still want to do it because I love it and I want to have a family and I want to be married <laughs> and I want to have my actual job. I don't know, I just, I want to be in a house. I just want to be happy and healthy and financially stable. That was a good explanation. That's where I want to be in 10 years, okay? Hopefully I'll be there. We'll check back with this video in 10 years and see how I how I did. Sarah asked, what is your hair process to make it look so amazing? So today I put little waves in my hair and then I just like separated them and brushed it out and then put hairspray. That's how I do that. Um, and then for when my hair is straight, it's normally, that's how it looks naturally. My hair is naturally like, pinched straight, but if I sleep on it wrong, it gets like crinkled and then I have to straighten it. Sometimes I use heat, sometimes I don't. Usually I don't have to, but that's what I do. One more question and then that is it for this video. Emily asked, what is your favorite food? P.S. I love you and Elijah. We love you too. My favorite foods are pizza, pasta, mashed potatoes, and the 
Taco Bell, Doritos, Locos, Tacos, <laughs> the Cool Ranch thing. I don't know, Elijah orders it for me, but I just found out about it and it's like my favorite food now. So I've been eating way too many tacos lately. But yeah, that is it for this q and I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope that I answered your question. If I didn't, don't worry, I will be doing another one in the future. If you guys did enjoy this video, please leave a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed, especially if you're coming from the Maddie and Elijah channel because I definitely owe you some videos because I said I would upload more and I haven't been. So here I am. I promise I'm going to start uploading more and I'll see you in the next video. Love you guys.